how to replace the actuator on a Kia Soul. This is for your climate control. I've already got my glove box taken out, but you'll have eight screws total. Three on the bottom, one here, one here, one here. That's the ones on the bottom. Then you'll have a screw here, uh, two screws on the top. They'll be over here and over here, lined up over here, in here. And you'll have one actually inside when you open up the glove box lid, right in the back of the, inside the glove, glove box. Once when you got all the eight screws, Phillips head, they're gonna be Phillips head screws. You wanna gently pull on the lid. It's just mounted on by clips. So just kinda of gently pull out towards you to get the glove box assembly out. Once when you've done that, before you let it drop, don't forget to unplug your glove box light. If you've done that, go and sit it down on the floorboard or out of your way. When you're looking inside, this is the view from the looking straight at it. You actually got two actuators. One here and one here. If you're trying to find out which one's not working, turn on the climate control, change the like the floor to the defroster, and find out which one it is. Therefore, you know which one goes to what. There's one that will be for your climate control, the AC and the heater temperature, which would be one of these. Then there's be it one that these motors be the one to move down to the floor to the defroster. So that's how you access your, uh, they call it Blendor Actuator. This is on a Kia Soul. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.